YouTube, it's Karen San Diego, and today I'm bringing you a video that's sort of highly requested. It's about how I clean Ryan's bottles. Uh, maybe a few weeks ago on Instagram, I posted a video of um, me getting her bottles together, and a few people asked me about what this thing is. This is a dishwasher rack for the baby bottles from OXO, and I use it to clean all of her bottles. Originally, what I used to do was individually clean them in the sink and the way I did that, which was also pretty good but took way too long, the way I did that was with like a traditional, like, oh no, what happened? The way I used to do that was with the traditional brush from OXO and um, this one you can put the soap in it and I use this soap by the brand Dapple um, this soap is specially formulated for babies. Um, it doesn't have a lot of chemicals and things that other traditional soaps use. And if anybody's wondering, the reason I have Ryan with me is she's having one of those with no. She's having one of those clingy days where she refuses to be put down, but mama got work to do. So she's going to be with us for this video. Granted, she behaves. So what I... <laughs> We're back. So what I do is I take all the bottles and these are the type of bottles that I use for Ryan. It's the Advent anti-colic bottles. Um, and if you take them apart, you'll if you take them apart, you'll see that they have like this anti-colic piece with them. So you just put that down. I'll dump out whatever excess milk, excess milk she has. And in order to properly put them in here, I'm going to just separate the nipple from this, like, nipple attachment thing here. You, there you go. Nope. Can't eat it. This nipple attachment thing. Okay. It's bedtime. One second. So, moms, you know how that goes. Anyway, we're getting right back to it. Daddy is putting her to bed. So you're just gonna separate the nipple part from this part. And then in the OXO um, thing, it has a space right here where you can slip the nipple right in. And the reason for that is I, don't know if, did I say it already? This is going into my dishwasher. So in order to make sure that her things are not just kind of flying around the dishwasher, it goes in securely like that. Then this piece is just gonna go right into this bin. This piece as well is gonna go right into that bin. And then this part is gonna go into the dishwasher. So I'm gonna show you that again with another bottle. So I have this bottle, it's the same brand, it's just pink. You're gonna take apart the nipple part from this. Just pop it right out. This part goes into the basket part. Up here, you can slip it right in. There's like a little, space right here where all the little nipples can fit in perfectly then this part you throw right in there and then this part goes in the basket dump the milk out all of these are going to go right into my dishwasher um, and i'm going to do that with all of these bottles i have three more bottles and i'll be right back so once you have all of the pieces inside of the bottle rack you're going to take Dapple, the same brand that makes the dishwasher liquid, and this you can find, the dishwasher liquid anyway, you can find easily at Target, Bye Bye Baby, um, I've seen it in like Walgreens, CVS, like any store. The dishwasher pods, however, I've only seen on Amazon, so you have to order these on Amazon, and I'll include a link to where I purchased them in the description box, but these are them. It's just, it looks like... It looks like a regular dishwasher pod, only just like the soap, it just has better ingredients for your baby things. Now, when you put it in the dishwasher, make sure, well, I don't know if this is even necessary, but this is what I do. I make sure that anything else that I'm putting in the dishwasher with Ryan's stuff is not something that has like a whole bunch of like, like I wouldn't put it in there with like really greasy or messy things, anything that had a lot of food on it, like it's pretty much things that were already rinsed off and clean, like glasses, 
um, that I drank out of or like clean um, plates that didn't have like any food left on it because I don't want to mix too much of like um, like really dirty dishes with her bottles. I'm not sure if that matters because it's going to be washed anyway, but that's just what I choose to do. So I usually run this load before I like cook dinner so that I'm not doing it with like really heavy greasy like trays and things like that. So let's get into how I put it in the dishwasher. So now this is my dishwasher. Um, there's a few things in here already. It's really just like a plate and like some cups. These are not things that are actually super dirty. Um, I usually would try to make sure that I'm running it with a few more things, but I don't have anything else that's dirty right now for the purposes of this video. I'm gonna go ahead and do it without that. So I'm just gonna take this thing. I need to figure out what exactly it's called. I'm not sure. It's a dishwasher storage holder. I'll link it. <laughs> and that is just gonna go right there. And it's really snug in between the two things. It's almost the perfect size. Um, then for her bottles, I'm just gonna put them in like that. And then you see some milk spilling down there, that's fine. I usually would rinse that out, but um, I didn't today because, I don't know. So ignore that. Um, now I'm gonna get a dishwasher pod, and this part is pretty much standard. If you have a dishwasher already, you know how to use a dishwasher. You just pop that in there, and then don't use any rinse aid when it comes to doing baby things. So this stuff has a lot of chemicals in it. You don't wanna make, sh make sure you do not use rinse aid. This part right here is for rinse aid, but I'm not using that. Usually I would for my stuff, or for her stuff, I don't do that. Some people say to use vinegar, but um, I've heard that that can mess up your dishwasher, so I wouldn't recommend it. And then, just gonna close it, and then I'm gonna put it on, focus. I'm gonna put it on the one hour cycle. It doesn't need to be on heavy or anything like that. It can be the quickest one. So just, boop. And there we are. So if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Make sure that you're subscribed. Let me know in the comments if there's anything else you would like to see from me. And I will see you in my next video. Where in the world is Karen San Diego? From BK to Belly, it's anywhere she say so. She changing your life, can see it straight through her eyes. Assistant moms every time she locked in. Extra, extra, read all about it.